What is going on you quality lot? Quality XA here today and today I'm bringing you guys another brand new Zer video. Now I'm pretty sure this is the third week in a row that he's been in the reef. But yes, he is in the reef again. This this guy is just not moving from the reef. Maybe this glitch where he's losing inventory is um, making him stay here. But I really do not know. But anyways, let's get right into this. So for the material exchange, we've got these standards. We've got the plasma drive as well as the void drive. You've got uh, free heavy ammo synthesis, you've got the free of coins, and then you've got glass needles. So no 10 heavy ammo synthesis, which is okay as long as we're getting them free of coins at a continuous rate. I'll pick up one of them. And now on to the exotics. So we have got a legacy engram, so you don't want to be picking that up. We've got the MP Reen Bellicose. So this is the one which holds you in the air while aiming. So it's actually quite a good one. It's not the best. Uh, we got this a couple of weeks ago, but uh, like I said then, it's just not the best exotic. When you're in PvP, if you're holding up in the air, a sniper will just take you out. Unless you've got a god aim and can kill some people while in the air. It's, it's pretty hard. So your increased intellect, increased discipline, ashes to assets, second thoughts, and better already. Shields start recovery immediately after all pickup. Pretty decent roll. Or should I say that? perk is just beautiful i just love that perk so you got young ahum kara spine increased trip mine grenade duration gain an additional trip mine grenade so like i said with this one before as well it's a pretty good exotic if you like using the golden gun as well as having trip mines on if you guys do not like using trip mines you're not going to want to pick pick this up it's as simple as that and also just to warn you guys if you haven't used trip mines in a while uh, they no longer stick to PvP players or enemies in general. So it's pretty annoying because that used to be a great feature. Because you used to be able to pick up a couple of kills that way. So you got increased intellect, increased discipline, momentum transfer, fast ball, pulse rifle loader and machine gun loader. So not too bad. Now on to the Warlock. So we've got the Void Fang Vestments. Now these are absolutely beautiful. So spawn with full grenades energy. And Axion Bolt Grenade spawns an additional C-cut. So very overpowered. Say if there's a, two Guardians and you throw one of these grenades, it will hit both of them. It will chase both of them, dealing a load of damage indeed. So you've got increased discipline, increased intellect, auto-rifle ammo, shotgun ammo, void armor, and void burn defense. So quite a nice uh, roll here, having auto-rifle and shotgun. If you're going to be running around using these grenades as a warlock, it will be pretty decent. But then you do have to be using the Void class, which um, isn't relevant at this point in time. I genuinely think Ark is, is just still beast. But uh, just my personal opinion. And now we're going to the beautiful weapon, which is the Bad Juju. You cannot fault this weapon. Still one of the best weapons in the game, in my opinion. Just looks wise, and it is just gorgeous on damage and one of the best pulse rifles in my opinion so what does this actually do you might ask so the exotic perk pretty much after each kill this weapon will reload instantly and increase your damage for a short time kills will help charge your super so it's very very good indeed pve not so much pvp this thing is a beast so it's fired in fully automatic but it still works as a pulse rifle so you can hold the trigger down but it'll still go prr, prr, prr. them sound effects were just gorgeous tell me about it so we've got smooth ballistics we've got soft ballistics smart drift control hip fire armor piercing rounds send it perfect balance and string of curses you've also got some uh, cool ornaments with these if you guys do manage to get some but the gun just looks beast even without the ornaments it just looks awesome indeed and yeah Definitely highly recommend picking that up if you guys do not have that already. Uh, void Fang Vestments. If you want to use a Warlock with Void, possibly using the Axiom Bolt Grenades, then you are going to want to pick this up. If you like using Trip Mines, get a Humkara Spine. And um, I wouldn't recommend getting the MP Reen Belly Close, especially the way PvP is at the moment with a lot of people running around with shotguns. And yeah, that's pretty much the video, guys. If you did enjoy, please do leave a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new around here. It's much appreciated and I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. Peace out. I hope you enjoyed.